Now, let us talk about decision-making skills. Now, you see the things coming down the road. You see all of these things happening. How do you make effective decisions? This is one of the key skills for, for leadership and management. Leaders must be able to make informed decisions in a timely way, right? Informed decisions in a timely way. Leaders must also be able to make tough decisions because sometimes the things are there to be done, but you have the role as the manager or the leader and you shite off to somebody else, but it was your responsibility to make that decision. No, I am also aware of the fact that sometimes the what are, what the, the decision making factors or the persons who are responsible to make the decision sometimes that role is not clear, right? Sometimes the role is not clear, so you're not sure who is to make the decision. And yes, you have different levels of management and different levels of leadership. And so if you understand what decisions am I allowed to make in my position versus that leader versus my superior, et cetera, then we are better able to make the decisions. But a lot of times the things are stalled in businesses and organizations because we are not making informed and timely decisions because we're not even certain whose decision it is, right? There's another downside to that when it is that okay, the decision is stuck with one person. And so we're not making timely decisions and that affects the, the, the pace of how things happen in an organization. So we must also be able to make tough decisions. We, there are tough decisions as it, as it, as it um, relates to even performance management. What do you do about that? Tough decisions as to how do we make a decision around what we will do as a business in this stage of the game versus that stage of the game. And so leaders and managers must be able to analyze data, weigh those pros and cons of the different options and make the decisions that align with the goals of the company.